cup of joe, baby. Yeah. Hey, folks, Stacy Jones here with the Basin Late Night Video Log. Got my old buddy Chadillac here. Yeah. And uh, been a lot going on. We hadn't talked to you in a minute, so we thought we'd fill you in. First of all, we are actually a restaurant now. That's the way we're operating. And uh, we got good news and bad news. The good news is that uh, we're open. Actually, we got the bad news. The bad news is you come in, you might smell popcorn. So if you don't like popcorn, because you come in and get a beer or something, you're going to get some popcorn to go with it. That's the way I figured it out. We also got pizzas. We got really, we started, Chadillac came up with it. It's it's uh, quesadillas. We got chicken, we got beef, and they are excellent. So come on by and try those out. I'm telling you, I've been eating them, and they are excellent. What's the other bad news? No, the bad news is over. What good news? The bad news is you got to smell popcorn. The good news is we got lots of popcorn. Damn. So you come on in, drink a beer, have some popcorn. As a matter of fact, most people have really enjoyed it. And I gotta tell you, I like popcorn. Yeah. I like popcorn. I've been eating a lot of popcorn too. I eat, I've been eating a lot of too much of everything, but that's me, you know. Now, what else is going on? Presidential election. How about that, man? Hmm? Right now, the mainstream media, all of them have called the election for Joe Biden. Yeah. Well, Joe Biden. But what they fail to uh, know, and I don't know, I guess they didn't take history, is uh, they don't call who the president is. Uh, there is a system that is called the Electoral College. And so when you voted in the state of Texas, everybody voted, and we voted for Trump. All of our electoral votes will be cast for Trump. The problem is that there's, there's several states that are in dispute. As a matter of fact, they've even called some of them for Biden, and it's really close. And there's been some voter fraud. And Donald Trump is fighting it, man. He is taking them to court. So this is probably going to end up being decided in the courts. Yeah. So let me tell you how that works. If it, it could end up in a tie. I was looking at that today. If it ends up in a tie or there's too big of a dispute, it'll go to the House of Representatives. Now, a lot of you people are going to know that the House of Representatives got more seats than the, than the Republicans do. So if the Democrats have got that, you think they're going to win it. But that's not true. And I'll tell you why. It's because they don't go by the total representatives. Each state gets one vote. And 37 out of the 50 states are Republican. <laughs> and so if it goes to that, Donald Trump will win in the, in the House of Representatives. Now, I've had some people tell me if, um, if Donald Trump ends up winning this, that we better be ready because the left's going to be burning down stuff, tearing it up. All I can tell you is this. Here in Texas, we're locked and loaded. We're ready. So uh, don't do it. Don't do it. Do not do it here. Do not do it here in Odessa, Texas, for real. I'm telling you, that'll be a mistake. Now, that's what the laws are, and that's what we're, you know, that's what we're going with. So I'm just letting some of y'all know because I had to learn some of this recently. You know, I I did learn some stuff. Now, um, and as you can see, I've got Mason Knights for Trump. That's who I that's who I support. And I know some of you don't like him, but I like him, and that's going to stay up there until we come up with the president. You know, one way or the other, you know. The problem with uh, the other, which would be the Democrats, is um, they are full of socialists. And, you know, back when I went to school, we knew words like socialism and uh, progressivism and communism. We knew those were bad words. But these young ones nowadays, they don't know. They haven't been taught. And so that's where we're at. As a matter of fact, I've got a Hodge Twins t-shirt. It was given to me by a very good friend. <laughs> he bought it for me. Hey, look here. Yeah, that cap right there, Hodge Twins. Now, I don't know if you know who the Hodge Twins are or not, but they're twin brothers. They are comedians, and they are conservative. 
So I would urge you to go on YouTube or somewhere and look up Hodge Twins and just enjoy some of those videos. They are so funny. They're conservative. Look at, look at my shirt says, it says, only you can prevent socialism. <laughs> That's the truth. That's the truth. And I'm gonna tell you the truth, man. I think that Donald Trump just won this election. I think he won it by a landslide. And I'm gonna tell you why I think that. It's because um, Donald Trump was doing a lot of rallies trying to pull up his support. And when he did those rallies, he was just packing the joints. I mean, there would be, you know, 57,000 people at some of these events, you know? Uh, but always in the many tens of thousands. Joe Biden was doing some rallies when he decided to come out of his basement, you know, old Sleepy Joe, you know, uh, uh, Beijing Biden, because he's got all the, t the ties with, with China. Anyway, that guy, when he decided to come out and do a rally, he had circles drawn, you know, and he couldn't fill the circles up, man. I mean, you know, they were social distancing, <laughs> about six feet apart. And he'd have, uh, he'd have about 10 to 25 people at each one of those. Now, now folks, listen, if all he can get is 10 to 25 people out to one of his rallies and Donald Trump's getting 57,000 out to some of his rallies, yeah. uh, who do you think won that? I mean, you know, that's what I'm saying. I just think, and a lot of these states that are in dispute, because this is going to go to the courts, they, the people there are really, they are really riled about this, man, because they know their state should have been red and it went blue. Um, what else do I want to talk about? Oh, do you know that a 170-year-old man name is Jason, 170 years old, voted for Joe Biden. Damn. Now, <laughs> Cadillac, that guy's old enough to know better. <laughs> 170 years old. But I'm going to tell you something. If you're listening to me, his name's Jason. Jason something. You're 170 years old. I want you to come into Basin Nights because I think this. I'm going to teach you a lesson. I'm going to get Cadillac to hold you while I whip you. That's what's going <laughs> 170 years old. Man, I might need some help. Yeah. <laughs> that's Superman there. Anyway, so folks, that's it. it we uh, The lights are going off in the place. It's late and everything. So if, you, if it looks a little different, that's what happened. But we're fixing to get out of here. Uh, we're going to do a little nod to, uh, to uh, the Hodge twins because we really enjoy them. So until next time, I'm Stacy Jones with Chadillac and Basin Knights. And say, yeah.